Happy today. I am William Brown from IamWilliamBrown.com. This is Disconnect to Connect, One Word Conversations. One Word Conversations is a self-discovery relationship building conversation designed to invite you to look at your language. Many times we come up with the wonderful words that we can think of and still find ourselves in a place of disconnection. So I am recommending that we have a one word conversation so we can learn a little bit more about ourselves, the person that we're speaking with, and just maybe build on our relationship. One More Conversations is brought to you by IamWilliamBrown.com, a place to help you be yourself and live your life. One way I spotlight what's available at the I Am William Brown store is our U-Cards. Our U-Cards are a part of the Beyond the Shell series. Um, It includes um, a couple children's books um, and a journal, You Are Complete Journal, um, and the cards. The cards are a game and intention setting cards. So I use these cards to um, set the intention for our conversation. Um, So these are the cards that I picked. I am unique, you are lovable, and there is no one you are than you. So this is the moment where I invite you to like, share, comment, ask questions. And if you're watching on YouTube, subscribe so you can be alerted of the next time we go live. Um, But yeah, I'm excited uh, again because uh, my guest has decided to be a part of the mystery and and be shocked and (laughs) on live on on the show. Uh, and as you can remember, some of the, the shows are, are, I guess, funny at first when, uh, when they are um, surprised by it, but we end up having a great conversation. So with that in mind, I am going to invite my guest in so we can have a conversation. Happy today. Thank you. Hello. This is the moment where I invite my guests to introduce themselves however it feels comfortable to them. I am Dominique Anderson, um, affordable housing warrior, mom, wife, social impact strategist, um, and owner of Dominique Anderson Consulting, Um, and I am excited to be here. Oh, wonderful, and welcome to this conversation. So, are you ready? (laughs) Let's go. Let's do it. Let's let's go. (laughs) Let's do this. Um, So, um, of all the words that I could think of and within my vocabulary, this is the word that came up um, for me. So how does the word classic land for you? Classic is music. Classic is clothes. Um, Classic is grace Hmm. and elegance. Wow. I am... Yeah, I get that. It's, you know, it's, it's for me... The first thing when I thought of classic, it was like old, right? You know, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's, <laughs> and maybe it's because I've reached that age where now I want to be considered classic, right? right, right. You know, right? You know? <laughs> right. Not, not just old. I just love old. classical music. I mean, before I, I use the language of meditation, that's I would use classical music to kind of just right. kind of center me and and calm, and and I also love jazz. I would do it the the, the same way, but you know, then it's like classical jazz. I'm like in heaven, right? Right? right. You know? Right, you know? <laughs> right. So uh, it's like really there is, you know, um, you know, classic really embodies that. I don't want to say it's been around for the time, but there's like a story. There's a richness to it. There's meaning more than just uh, this something up, um, just happening. Right. Right. Agreed. I um, was cleaning the other day and I was listening to opera and I reconnected with that, that love, the thing that is opera that you, you can listen to it in any language. And mm. especially when you go see it live, you don't even, you may not even speak the language, but the story right. is so present and the pomp and circumstance of it all just, I don't know, it just made me happy. Right. It's, it's, it's kind of, for me, this is some of the things that goes through, goes through my head that um, when I'm like listening and like really enjoying a song in another language, um, it's like, I'm like, 
am I like have tapped in something that I don't really understand or should I be listening to this? Do they, right. it's like, maybe they're saying something crazy right now. And I just, you know, <laughs> you know, um, and it's, it's, it's just, it's just really, it's like, just enjoy the song, right? Just enjoy. You know? just, just let it go. Just let it go. And, and clue in. Right. <laughs> right. It's, it's just, you know, it's just really, you know, like I said, for, for me, um, you know, really embracing the classics right the right. um the you, you know just you know you have to put in in something i don't i don't know if you remember the um you know the soda wars and um coke and um mm-hmm. they yeah. tried to do new coke and <laughs> right and that didn't work out so instead of saying <laughs> okay we're just going to go back to the old coke they said we're gonna go with classic coke you know right, right? right. and so right. it's Work. like all right we screwed up um <laughs> and and it's like so i'm trying to figure other than myself because i reached a certain age um right. that you know that i want to embrace classic i'm, I'm trying to think uh, where where else i really embrace um classic as it is that you know, there is an appreciation that it has mm-hmm. been around, that there is something to it. There is, there is meaning. Um, mm-hmm. Is there any, anywhere for you that um, like classic, like really shows up and that there's like this appreciation on a level, maybe that you understand or not? Mm-hmm. Music. Music is mm-hmm. clearly everything for me, right? It mm-hmm. just is, it can put you in any space. It reminds you of anything. And so, uh, I like a lot, a range of music, right? And so I can listen to uh, James Taylor or I can listen to uh, Boney James, mm. right? And so music is classic to me. Mm. And uh, I think right. that's that's that was my first word. And that really is the biggest piece of classic influence on me. Yeah, it's, 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 it's really, um, you know, I did a show, um, um, I think a couple uh, last week. Um, I I also do a show, Healing Conversations, and we did um, the uh, the healing power of song, um, and just looking at how um, there's a so- there's songs that we know and and don't know that um, mm-hmm. that can have this this power for us. Right. Mm-hmm. And it's just like all it it just comes on. I don't know the words, you know, it could be in another language yeah. or something. And it just hits on a level that it is just, all right, this is this is what I need it right now. This is um uh, you, you know, th- this this is what I'm what I'm into. And I and I and I and I think for for me, I it's it's for me. I'm I'm just I'm just trying to say I I don't want to feel that I've reached the age where I'm like a crotchety old guy, <laughs> but you know, but it's like I was because I was about to say the the words that came to my mind was back in the day, right? And it's like, oh, good lord, I'm not going to say that, right? <laughs> you know, it happens to us all. Like, <laughs> it happens to us all. Listen, when you right. realize you're on the other side of not right, young, uh, and it's it's just like there are so many parts of our society. It feels like for me that we want to just tear down um, and like create something new and not appreciate the years that, you know, that went involved. And so it's like, we can't get to, in some case, to really appreciate classic because we're so busy with the next. And so we're missing, you, you know, we're, we're missing history. We're missing meaning. We're right. missing appreciation because of that. And, right. and so is that, is that old people talking, right? <laughs> no, I think it's an appreciation for what was and um, uh, hoping that there will be that classic touch to what is, you know, and what's mm-hmm. coming. Right. Um, housing, real estate is a great space, right? I, I'm, in that space and especially in the affordable housing space, this is a conversation we have all day Hmm. about the continuity of communities and neighborhoods. And there is a, there is something to be said for the classic architecture and the classic home and the homes that are, that were there and were built. And now they've been replaced by something that is 
brand new, but vastly uh, less quality, right? right? Oftentimes, sometimes. Right. Uh, so that's that's a big question, and there is no problem with looking to the past and saying, you know what, they they did it, and it was it was great, right. you know. Right. It's a big conversation. There is there is um, I. You know, I'm a, a self-awareness coach. Um, and so, you know, a part of the conversations that I have with people is about um, um, transition and, and you know, and how they see themselves and how they are aware of how they're, sh they're showing up. And I was talking to someone recently um, that um, that was just saying things like, I mean, she's, she was in a, in a very difficult place. She was just going through a divorce and, um, um, and she was, you know, um, saying, you know, I was, I'm a stay at home mom. I've never, you know, I've never been in a workplace. I've never, you know, all of these things that she's not. And there was a part of me that said, um, are you're here right now. Right. You know? And, and it's like, mm -hmm. yeah. And it's like, yeah. well, you have some skills, right? You know, so you, you know, if you didn't have any skills, I don't think we would be talking right now. You wouldn't be right. here, and and I think, and she was like just stopped, and I was mm -hmm. like, it's just really, and I think sometimes when we when we look at housing or we look at something that was here for a while and that's. Right can stand the test of time. There was something, right? <laughs> that was created right. within that to cause it to to be here. It may not be exactly what we want or what we thought it would be. Right. Um, but the fact that it still exists means means something. And and I think the more that we um I think embrace what classic means i mean because you know i have um a friend that he's into classic cars right and like mm -hmm. finding he's i mean yeah. the f i i like practical right you know i try you know some my kids when they were growing up they they hate they knew when dad bought them a gift because it was something that they could use, right? <laughs> you know, <A> new notebook. <laughs> right? You know, I mean, it Go was off, like, Dad. okay, it's like, gee whiz, thanks, Dad, right? You know, right? You know, Socks, um, right? <laughs> you know, but um, th there, you know, to 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 have you know this person, you know, buy this classic car, and like spend all types of money to like refurbish it and do all right. these things. And, right. you know, Hey, come over to my house and take a look at what I did. And it's like, you know, it's like, yeah, it's, it's cool, but you know, you can't take it to Walmart. Right. You know, I mean, you can't, you know, you can't, you know, right. You know, and it's just like, it's like you put more, more money in this car than mm -hmm. you, you know, in the car that you use every day. And it's like, right. I, you know, and I'm, and it's like, I appreciate it, you know, and, you know, and I can see the enjoyment, you know, that, mm -hmm. that right. he's experienced, but at the same right. time, it's like, what, what are you, what are you doing? It's like, right. I feel like I'm missing something there, right? You know, there is, <laughs> there is something right. that I can like embrace and that it is not. And because especially when, you know, I'm thinking about housing again and, right. and, and real estate that, you know, sometimes it's like, people will say it's cheaper just to tear it down. Right. You, you know, than to, Absolutely. Um, but then, but what, are, what else are we tearing down? Mm -hmm. What, what um, else, what are we saying by that? So my grandfather was a brick mason in Nashville. He built a lot of this city, right? Mm. Uh, built, built different buildings throughout the city. And um, he built his, my mother asked for him to build her house when she mm. was probably about five or six and he did. Right. Mm. So he built his only child and his wife, a house, mm. uh, nice plot of land in the city, built it, built the garage, the whole thing. Great house, three levels. Um, fast forward, my mom's in her seventies. None of us, my brothers and sisters and I don't live where well, my sister lived here. Um, and we all have different skill sets. My particular skill set was negotiating deals and making things happen, right? In the real right. estate and other spaces. I was a publicist for a long time. Right. And so 
I moved back and this house is in just kind of disarray. She doesn't live in the house. She lives in another house, but that house is in kind of disarray and she doesn't want to pay somebody to do the big work. You know what I mean? She's kind of mm -hmm. chewing gum it all together. Right. So it comes to a point where environmental courts and just discrupulous developers are coming after her through the, the codes and environmental court route. Right. Um, so I negotiated a deal to get um, to sell the house before they, they took it and she could at least have made something from this property. Right. Um, and so the developer that I negotiated this with said, well, you know, I like to restore homes and, you know, bring them back to what they were and all of these great things. And so like, OK, let's do it. Nice. Um, two weeks later, gone, completely leveled. Wow. And not a brick, not a not a brick, not a conversation, not a call, not anything. And I wow. ran into him and he said, oh, hey, yeah, you know, it just turned out it was just so much and it was just easier. It was just we just wound up having to demolish it. And I, I had a lot of choice words, a lot of magic Great. special words. <laughs> magic um, special words. Classic and, words, right? <laughs> classic words. And uh, I told him, you know, you could at least give him my mom brick from the house. Hmm. And so that's that's where you took that classic. And I understand that it was there was a lot of work to be done. But honestly, I think he could have done the work. Right. But right. he just went for now. It's two very ugly, tall and skinny on that one lot. Right. Wow. Oh, I, I, I felt that. And it's like at least a brick, right. Or something. Right. Mm -hmm. Um, right. and it just, and, and I think the fact that for me, even if going into the, you know, the start of it, Oh yeah, we're going to, you know, restore this. Mm -hmm. It's like, where was that in his mind when the demolition happened? I mean, it's right. like, it's just like, it didn't happen, you know, it, it didn't right. happen at all. Yeah. Um, and, and, and I, and, and I, and I think it's, it's sometimes, you know, I'm, I'm looking back at, you know, how I don't listen to, or I haven't, let's just say, I haven't listened to classic, classical music in a long time. And, and I can remember um, when I stopped um, doing it consistently because, um, someone made fun of me. They're like, what are you, what, what are you doing? It's like, you just, you know, get, you know, give me your black card right, right now. Right. right? You know, it was like, right? it was right, like, it right was, <laughs> it's like, just, just hand it over. Right. You know, no, um, no. <laughs> and, and it was, and it was like, Okay, well, um, all right, I'm not going to do this, like at least not in public, right? You know, where you know, right. where, you know, or, you know, or something. And then I just got distracted, busy doing right. other things, and I'm just really, and I don't know, it's like I haven't been thinking about that in a while, and it was just mm -hmm. that was so, how quickly something that I loved and cared about and found pleasure in mm -hmm. just kind of like left left my mind. And I think that's, right. that's, I was like, that's how it was uh, coming up for me. It's like, dude, you do the same thing, right? You know, it's like, mm -hmm. you know, get off to the developer right now, right? You know, it's like, look right. at how you see how classic can just leave you yep. um, with without thinking. And for, for good idea, you know, I wanted to be hip. I wanted to be cool. I wanted to keep my card for a while. You know, I've given away my card now. And so it's like, you know what? I, I think they've pickpocket my, you know, it's like, it just one day it was like, yeah, I don't know where it is. <laughs> you know? Just facing your wallet with it. Right. <laughs> yeah, it's like, what was there? I, I, I think that's what a belt card was. Right? Right. You know? I think it was um, yeah. But, um, but yeah. And, and it's just like, where can I find and reconnect the classic? And I, and I think like you were saying, it's appreciation. Mm -hmm. It's, it's really finding appreciation and, you know, and gratitude for what's, you know, what's here, yeah. what, what was created. Mm -hmm. hmm. That's yeah. A good That's a good, my brother, my, my mom always had, season tickets to the to TPAC, Tennessee Performing Arts Center. And uh, that meant that we would go to the opera or symphony something together. And then when I was about nine, nine or 10, no, probably about 10, 10 or 11, 
she started sending me, I wish she would drop me off and I would go. So I would be this little kid all dressed up going to the opera or the symphony or whatever and sitting up in the box by myself. Right. Right. I just aged myself because that lets you know when you could send your kids somewhere by themselves. Right. But, right. Right. Um, like... I would go and, uh, and go by myself. So my brother is six years older than me and he got into a lot of things before me. So I was this weird kid who listened to classical and like rock and all these things. And, but my brother was this super wanted to be street hip hop guy. Right. And so I listened, my mom was very insistent on me just being kind of this way that she wanted me. I'll never forget when I went downstairs, my brother had all his records again, aging myself. He had all his records mm -hmm. and I looked at this collection and there was this record and there was these guys in, uh, in a hot tub and this girl was standing in a bathing suit. It was two live crew. Mm. Oh boy. And I put it on <laughs> and I was like, this is it. And then I listened to his NWA record and I listened and I was like, oh, where has this been? <laughs> a slippery slope from there. It was just like, that's, that's it. And then the classical went to the back and, and it was, it was just a very long love affair with hip hop and, and rap and Uncle Luke. Right. Um, <laughs> an affinity for Uncle Luke. I'm a Hurricanes fan. Like it's a whole thing. Um, so, oh yeah. boy! So yeah, you put that classic on classic. Didn't have a chance. Right? <laughs> I saw that record. And I was like, why is this woman doing this? And then I put it. On. I was like, what did you say? Like, oh, I like all of this. My brother was like, oh man, what did I do? And I was like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, you did it. It's your fault. So now here we are. And I have to have all of this. Yep. I think that's just when the, the label first came out um, or, or around that time is when they started putting labels. So, uh, so, yep. uh, so Your that's, advice, that's right? funny. So, uh, it it's, funny. Uh, so it's worth this. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, label nothing. <laughs> they don't mean me. <laughs> and 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 now it's considered classic uh, hip hop, right? <laughs> it's classic. It is classic. Classic greatness. They made the NWA movie and everything. See? Like, see, it turned out fine. Right. It turned it turned out fine. It's like oh, and, and that eleven year old now. It's like oh, what you know? What was I missing? Right. <laughs> right. Oh. And one day we'll talk about my love affair with Kenny Rogers. That's a whole <laughs> absolute love. Oh boy, that's that's great. Oh, I am. It it it's it's kind of funny. I just I just I mean I saw the image of like I don't know. In in my mind, it's like oh, so you see the al album cover, right? And mm -hmm. then it's like, huh, this this looks different. And just mm -hmm. let's just put it on, right? And it's just like. Whoa! <laughs> what? Like, you shrunk all those words together that way. You just what with you and how? I don't even know what that means, but I like all of it. Right? It's like, oh, uh, oh boy. Uh, so, um, yeah, I just, it's like, oh uh, boy, and it's um, the loss of innocence, and and I oh. and I think it's yeah. it's 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 really. And, and and like you said, to 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 go back to classical uh, music for me, and like I said, even before I, I I had words and and kind of knew you know meditation and quieting myself that you know I could just you know hear the music, feel the music, you know, be with you know you know I'm doing my homework, I'm being creative, I'm doing all you know all of these things. This was. This was how you know classical music, you know, kind of showed showed up for me, um, and and it it was it was it was really look I um I was always surprised like on the Grammys that they had like you know a classical music section in um, right. category and always give and it's like dude it's like someone. Didn't this song like win? Like, man, what did he do differently that you know <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> that you're given this 
person the, um um it but it's like it sounds the same to me but right. um um Dreams, but it's horns, yeah right it's you know it it is it is same thing and i and i and i think um what's coming up for me now it's like the nuance of classic right mm -hmm. there is there is always something and i mean i am this is my because of this conversation my today i am going to work with classical music today i am going mm -hmm. to put something on and yeah. and and i'm going to try to remember um you know um you know some songs what's coming to mind don giovanni and you know i love mozart and um a lot of some some box stuff um okay. but i am i am going to try to listen to it and find appreciation at, from the 54 year old that hasn't listened in a number of years and okay. kind of see if i still hear it the same way Mm -hmm. If there is, you know, if there is a different listening, is there some different, um, you know, elements that now that, you know, that I'm also classic, right? Right, right, you know, <laughs> that, that uh, there is uh, appreciation. It's, it's, it's like watching, um, you know, Bugs Bunny cartoons as a kid. It's like, you know, I'm laughing and my mom's sitting back and behind right. me laughing a lot more than me. And it's like, what, what does she right. see? <laughs> you know, right. what, what is she watching right. that I'm like, <laughs> you know, that I'm missing because it seems a lot more funnier <laughs> to, to right. her, right. you know? And, and I, and I, and I think that um, what the inquiry for me today is to, to listen, you know, as I guess the adult, as the, mm -hmm. as you know, with more years, right? You know, mm -hmm. far yeah. removed from, <laughs> you, and, you, you know, um, you know how it showed up to me in the past, right? You right. know, it's like right. it's like far removed, <laughs> far removed from eleven. Oh, oh my god, yeah. Um, I think, you know, when you think about that that classical maybe for me in the opera space ave maria Pavarotti's version oh uh, yeah that yeah. really it the song no matter really who does it always just set something for me it just hmm. there's a piece with that and so that took me back to Pavarotti, and i really enjoy his operas and, and not that they're not others right. um there are some other opera singers and i grew up with an opera singer at my grandmother's church and she was just really i mean that there's something about opera that's right. just really calm for me right and then classical I, I study and work with different versions of it so bach when i need to be focused but i need a little energy mm. bach or Mo mozart is really who i go to for that kind of upbeat right. energy wow yeah it's like I don't even have those categories. I would just put some on and just kind of do this. So yeah, I need to. I need to get okay if I'm feeling this no, way. This is what I put right. You know, I need to like come write this down. I just like just put it all together, classical, and 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 just go from there. It's it's interesting that you you have rem reminded me that um, I enjoy opera more than musical theater. Mm -hmm. Musical, oh, yeah. music, musical theater gets on my nerves, and I and I, I've been on in musical theater, right? Mm -hmm. I've done like shows, mm -hmm. and 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 I don't know why that. Right. Um, and I'm I'm not. I was uh, I was about to admit something, um, but um, yeah, I'll just do it since it's it's in the space, and I and I've said that I will You're be honest. Uh, I'm out now, and it's like, okay, what is he talking about? <laughs> um, I couldn't get through Hamilton. I just I. Oh. I, no, I no. wanted to, but no, I couldn't. I either. Right? I couldn't either. <laughs> it's like, and my daughter was like, she's eleven, and she said, or she's, oh, she's thirteen. She said, oh, I tried to watch Hamilton. My friends were so excited, and I put it on, and she was like, Mom, it's probably my age. And I was like, Oh no, no, no. I, didn't I, I didn't enjoy it. I know, and it was just like there were so many people there. It's like, oh, you're gonna, so, you're gonna love it, and I can say, and I was like, oh yeah, I've done musical theater. I kind of get it, you know, um, and and I was just like, I am so, uh, you know, it's like I'm not gonna tell this, and I just like admitted it there. But it was just, it, you know, like I said, that's why I don't have my card, right? <laughs> you know. <laughs> 
<laughs> well, I guess she'll take mine too because I didn't. Right. I, I was like, I was very glad I didn't pay a hundred dollars to go see it. You know what I mean? Right. It's it uh, is you, you know, and I and I think there are some people going to come after my theater card. You know, you know, it's like uh, okay, now we just 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 kind of take it. But and right. I don't know about the difference in opera for me. Mm -hmm. It is there is so much more. It's 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 like the language doesn't get in the way, mm -hmm. right? It's it's I think I, I think that's the only way that I that that I can think think of it. Mm -hmm. It's it it's just like no matter it's like because it's together, right? Because mm -hmm. it it you know because you're you're speaking and singing, you're you're sharing every everything, mm -hmm. everything is a part of it. Um, the the song it it kind of just leads it and and it's like for for me. This is this is how, the reason why I don't use Instagram and you're like how is this connected? This is this is how um, musicals and Instagram shows up for me. So you're like, all right, let's kind of put these together. <laughs> it is, it's like Instagram. It's like you're going through your day and it's like, oh, I'm going to put this on the gram. It's just I'm going to stop what I'm doing, mm -hmm. take yeah. a picture, and put it up. Mm -hmm. I don't work that way. It's like the same thing with. Um, with musicals for me, it's like, mm -hmm. hey, I'm feeling these emotion. I'm gonna stop and break out in a song. In a Doesn't song. happen. <laughs> right, 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 you know? right? It's That's like good. it's. That's it's good. Like, yeah. It's yeah. like I no, right? You know, it's just like I like musicals, like some musicals. I'm a West Side Story fan. Right. Or right. There, there's a there's a few of them that I really like. Right. Right. But they're they're classics. Right. They're classics. Right. I think it was the maybe the hip hop with the music. I, it was just too much. It was it's it was too, too, many, too much. You're, tr things. you're trying too much, right? <laughs> you're not trying, I, don't, you know? I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't need that. Right, and it, it's it's like it goes back to for me. I'm connected it into the I I guess the the faux classic. You know, you have right. you know people like will um, kind of tear down a. a a Victorian house and then right. put up a, a faux Victorian house and think, you know, right. Oh, it's just as good. No, it's not. You know? a modern farmhouse. Right. It's just like, right. really, you know, it's mm -hmm. like, right. it's, it's, it's that type of thing. So it's like, you're going to love to, you know, it's like, if you love West side story and all this other kind of stuff, this is, it's like, right. no, no. no. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, sorry, no, thank you. I, I don't, you know, I don't <laughs> it's it's it 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 is something because there's a lot of and it's in some cases I'm not going to get get on the performing arts and and the the arts community. It's like, um, but it's there is so much of this recycled formula type of thing that mm -hmm. look that um, that um, it feels like we're missing the real creative genius and an opportunity to really mm -hmm. flow and and i and i think for for me with classical music and um because look you know if i really really think about it um classical music what i label as classical music was popular music of its day right you sure. know sure. right you know so sure. it was but it was popular music for a certain segment of the, the people, right? Yeah. You know, right. Um, so it's like uh, you know, so um, so it is, it is, it is that uh, you know that type of thing. So it's like when you really break it down, it's like, huh? So maybe it was a lot of people didn't right. to kind of right. hear this, um, right. but um, but really, the the more that I can 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 really kind of embrace. Um, what's going on today and what is experience, how that experience, you know, that's why we say, you know, classic rock, right? You know, mm -hmm. it's like you're rich to the, okay. you know, right. our, our yacht radio. I don't know if you do that. Oh, right? <laughs> Every day. I love that. Right? <laughs> it's the best. It's like, it's like I don't know why it's not just Michael McDonald radio, but it's, you know, it's like, but I mean, I mean it's it like Right. It's like, that's, that's what it is, but it, it's, it just kind of, it gets to a point, And I think that's the, the other thing 
with with classic, it gets to the point that it crosses this this period of time where mm-hmm. it's it's no longer present. It's mm-hmm. like it's right. past, but it's an enjoyable past, right? right? It's something that I choose to bring in that it's it's just go and it kind of takes you. It's mm-hmm. beyond it's beyond the language. It's beyond right. it's like there are there are some songs from from my childhood that I have no idea what the words are. Um, but mm-hmm. it's like or I know what the words are, and it's like that's just nonsense right <laughs> you know right. why did i like that right yeah. right you know? <laughs> my sister used to sing you know when he said i want a new drug she thought it was right. truck so she used to sing i want a new truck right nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Wrong. oh that's that's funny but <laughs> it, it it um, it's it's a nice little time capsule, but um, yeah, I think we could talk about this for hours because I'm thinking as as more that we we talk, the the more songs that are coming into my head, and it's like, okay, is that classic? No, that's not classic. That's just old, right? You're right, right, right. You're it's right. like you know, it's like you know, and it's and, and that's funny for for me that it's like, what makes it classic versus what makes it just it's just. Right. You know, old can be classic, but old sometimes sometimes old can be just old, right? You know, right? right. You know? I have some classics. I have some songs I call classics. So my husband will say, "Yeah, classic piece of crap," and I'm like, "Hey, right. classic <laughs> to me. all the bad." So, is there anything that's that's come up in this conversation that you would want to leave everybody with? Uh, I think that what, what's classic to you, right? Mm. Classic for you may not be classic to somebody else. Right. And in music, it, mm. lean into it and let it open up whatever it opens up and acknowledge that. Right. Right. Yeah. It's like re- really kind of embrace what um what is speaking to you. Right? Yeah. And what you yeah. need to continue to bring on your journey. I'm yeah. Like I said before this, before this conversation, it was like, oh, I remember when I used to like classical music. Now I get to, I get to hear some it again today. So thank you, Dominic, right. um, for that. This, uh, this has been a, a, a classic conversation. Um, um, so um, thank you very much. I'm going to put you back in the green room here. This has been a pleasure. Thank okay. you. Same. Oh, it's what's classic to you. And don't, um, I think what I've, what I've got um, from this conversation, it's a level of appreciation and gratitude. If it's music, if it's real estate architecture, um, the arts, you know, and please don't at me because I didn't like Hamilton, but, um, um, but, um, but yeah. Just recognize the classic things um, that are showing up in your life. Hmm. I hope this conversation has brought value to you, not just to your day, but to your life. I invite you to reach out to me at IamWilliamBrown.com to have your complimentary coaching session um, to help you be yourself and live your life. Because the world wants you, the world needs you, but the world isn't waiting for you. So go be you. Have a great rest of the day, and I'll see you next time on One Word Conversations.